Satyabama Institute of Science and Technology. I am Dr. Minu Susan Jacob, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science and Engineering, Satyabama Institute of Science and Technology. Today we are going to discuss the topic Simple Linear Regression. Under this, we are going to cover the topics what is predictive analysis, predictive analysis technique, simple linear regression, and the methodology. Predictive analysis is the branch of data analysis that involves using historical data to predict the future outcomes and trends. Simple linear regression is the fundamental technique using which we develop a model to find out the relationship between dependent variable and the independent variable using a simple linear equation. Dependent variable is the main variable of interest or the target variable which we are going to predict using other variables and this variable is also called as target variable or the response variable. In data mining, we try to analyze how the changes in the independent variable affect the dependent variable. Independent variables are the input variables using which we are actually going to predict the output variable or the target variable. And this is also called as predictor variables or the target variable or the features. In data mining, we try to analyze the relationship between independent variable and the dependent variable or how the changes in the independent variable affect the dependent variable. Suppose we want to predict the sales of a product based on various factors. In this scenario, the dependent variable would be sales because it is the quantity we are going to predict. The sales value will change based on the values of the independent variables such as marketing spent, price of the product, seasonability and customer demographics. If you look into this uh, plot, you will be able to understand what is independent variable and what is dependent variable. As I already mentioned, dependent variable is the variable which we are going to predict based on the value of independent variables. For example, in this case, our independent variables are age, education, qualification, income, marital status. And based on these values of independent variables, we are going to predict the dependent variable, which is in this case, whether the customer is going to purchase the item or not. So, uh, as you can see the values here, if it is one that indicates that the customer has purchased the item, and if it is zero, that means the customer has not purchased the item. So based on this independent variable, we are going to predict the dependent variable. In a summary, the dependent variable is what we want to predict or explain while the independent variables are the factors we use to make that predictions or explanations. Data mining algorithms analyze the relationship between these variables to create predictive models and gain valuable insights from the data. So the choice of dependent and independent variable is purely dependent on the problem statement which you are going to choose. Let's uh, look into the topic simple linear regression. In simple linear regression, as I already mentioned, we are having dependent variable and independent variable and we have a single uh, independent variable using which we are going to predict the dependent or the target variable. And the goal here is to create a straight line that best fits the data points and can be used to predict the dependent variable based on the independent variable. Uh, if you look into this graph, you can see in x-axis we have year of experience and in y-axis we have the salary in rupees. And here year of experience is your independent variable and uh, salary is your dependent uh, variable. That means based on the year of experience, we are going to predict the salary in rupees. So if you see the previous plot, we can see that real value or observations are uh, plotted in green dots and predicted values are covered by the uh, straight or the red regression line. The regression line shows a correlation between the dependent and the independent variable. The good fit of the line can be observed by calculating the difference between actual values and predicted values. But as we can see in the previous plot, most of the observations are close to the regression line and hence we can say that the model is good for the training set. Let's see the equations used in uh, single linear regression. We have uh, the equation y is equal to mx plus b for that wherein y is the dependent variable or the target variable which we are going to predict and x is the independent variable which is used for prediction. 
and m is the slope of the regression line which shows the relationship between x and y and b is the y intercept which represents the value of y when x is equal to 0. So, based on this we are going to identify the value of y using mx plus b. And what are the steps we are going to follow in order to uh, implement simple linear regression? The first step which we are following is data collection wherein we gather the historical data for both dependent and independent variables from your data set. The second step is data exploration wherein we analyze the data to identify any patterns, correlations or insights and also for any kind of outliers or missing data so that it will not affect the regression model. And uh, the third step is data pre-processing wherein we, we prepare the data by cleaning it uh, and uh, filling up the missing values and other uh, scaling features and splitting of uh, data set into training testing data set. Everything we do such that the model will give you uh, accurate values. The next step is model building wherein we apply the simple linear regression uh, algorithm and uh, we build the model by having the values of as I already said uh, y equal to using y equal to mx plus b we calculate the uh, we may build the model. Next step is model evaluation wherein we test the model on the testing data to assess its performance and make any necessary adjustments or improvement needed in order to improve the accuracy if required. And the last stage is prediction wherein once the model is ready and tested for the application what we can do is we can use it for making future predictions in the case of any new scenario or any new situation. In short simple linear regression is a predictive technique suitable when there is a clear linear relationship between the dependent and independent variable. If the relationship if your data set is really complex and if your relationship is not within the limit of uh, a single independent and dependent variable in that case you will not be able to use this simple linear equation instead we will go for other methodologies like multiple linear regression or other uh, algorithms which is available. Thank you.